We are here today to congratulate Dr. Paul for winning the Nobel Peace Prize. And we are also here today to demand the Chinese government to release Dr. Paul and all prisoners of conscience. The Norwegian Nobel Committee has awarded the Nobel Peace Prize for 2010 to Dr. Paul for his long and long violent struggle for fundamental human rights in China. We congratulate Dr. Lao Xiaobo and he well deserves it. Lao Xiaobo is among a large number of dissidents who have been detained or harassed since December 2008 after issuing an opening letter calling on the National People's Congress Standing Committee to ratify the International Conflict of Civil and Political Rights and launching Charter 08 a declaration calling for political reforms and human rights, published on December 9, 2008. What the Charter advocates conform to the spirit of the Nobel Peace Prize. Since its release, more than 10,000 people inside and outside China have signed. On December 8, 2008, Liu was detained in response to his participation in Charter 08. He was formally arrested on June 21st and 2009 on suspicion of incitement to subvert state power. He was tried on the same charges on December 21st, 2009 and sentenced to 11 years in prison on December 25th. Other well-known activists and writers such as Wu Jai, Guo Xijin, Xi Dao, Wang Bingjiang are still in prison or under constant surveillance. And other Chapter 08 original secretary, Xi Chan, democracy activist and writer, Liao Yanbin, was arrested on June 28 this year by police for the same charge as Liu. We urge the Chinese government to respect freedom of peaceful expression of opinion by the people and immediately release Liu and other dissidents. Finally, before the announcement of the Nobel Peace Prize, Deputy Foreign Minister of China, Wu Yi, President of the Nobel Peace Prize Committee, not to award the prize to Liao Xiaobo. We want to express our strong protest. The Deputy Minister's action is an insult to the Nobel Peace Prize. We hope the international community will recognize the freedom, suppression of human rights by the Chinese government and urge them to improve the human rights situation in China.